Hey, my name is Kevin and I'm the Helpful Hero, here to help you leverage the awesome power that is HubSpot. In this video, I wanna walk you through how you can go about redesigning your existing HubSpot website and give it a nice, fresh, new look. I'm gonna go over HubSpot's content staging feature, which is a little hidden, and so I wanna just walk you through the few actionable steps that you can take to start redesigning your website today without fear of interrupting or making anything funky on your live website. So without further ado, let's jump right into the video. We're gonna go ahead and start right here in the HubSpot CMS. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna jump straight into the content staging tool. And this is a little hidden. So if we're looking at this page, what we wanna do is we wanna go down under more tools and then go to content staging. Now here is where you're going to be able to see all of the existing pages under whatever domain you have set in your account. So right now, this is just pointing towards the blog, which isn't super helpful. So we're gonna go down and select myhelpfulhero.com, where you can see I've got tons and tons of different pages built. So we're gonna go ahead and look for a certain page just to stage so that I can walk you through this. So I'm gonna go ahead and say, We'll do our services page, and we're gonna go ahead and do this one right here. So what we wanna do is we wanna actually stage this page, obviously, um, and by clicking this nice orange button, it's gonna give you the option to do two things. One, stage a blank page, which is typically what I recommend, and that's gonna give you the ability to select a new theme or template or what have you. So I'm gonna go ahead and say Sage Blank Page. And that's going to basically open us up in our um, different themes. Now, obviously these are all of my clean themes, child themes, and so on and so forth. This would be whatever theme that you're using. So we're gonna go ahead and go, I'm gonna use this theme right here, and then I'm gonna go ahead and pick any of these templates. Just because this is on top, I'm gonna go ahead and use that thank you template, and then I'm gonna say update page. This is basically going to take that services page and attribute the new template to it. The thing you have to keep in mind is all of your content won't automatically transfer over into a new template or a new theme. This is part of the manual process of redesigning the page. And so as you can see here, there is our nice thank you template, it's just a simple template that I usually like to use for these demos. And we can start going through and designing this page. Now I'm not gonna walk you through designing and moving modules, I can do a, a whole other video on actually using clean and using the CMS. This is mostly just to walk you through the content staging feature. So once you've got your page looking great, you've got all your new content in, the one thing that I will mention is if you go over to the settings tab, all of your existing meta text, like the page title and meta description, the URL, that all remains the same. So it's not as if you're needing to go through and replace any of that existing content. That's what makes this whole content staging feature pretty sweet. So once we have this all looking good, what we wanna do is we wanna actually click this yellow, pub, yellow, orange publish to staging button. Now I know that button looks a little scary because you're like, oh, is this gonna take this page live? No, it will not. And this is one of the common questions that I get. So what we wanna do is we wanna go ahead and say publish to staging, which is going to put that in this staged proof category right here. What we wanna actually do is any of the existing pages that we want to redesign and then basically launch together, we wanna to collect them all here in the staged proof area, if you will. Once that's good and you're like, okay, I've got all you know, five, 10, however many pages that you want ready to go, what you're gonna do is you're just gonna come down here, check this box, come over to publish. Actually, we're gonna check that box one more time. We're gonna come over here to publish and we're going to publish that. Or we can select however many pages that we want and say publish page to live domain. That'll make sure that all of your pages will go up once so that your entire redesign is super seamless and it's not just one page, then the next, then the next. It all happens um, 
automagically, like I like to call it. Now, there's one last thing I wanna uh, have you keep in mind as you're doing this. Be very mindful of not changing around any of the URL structures because this will kinda get a little bit wonky. If you do want to change a URL structure on any of your newly designed pages, I highly recommend that you do that after the fact, after you've published everything live, and then be sure to go into HubSpot and create your redirects. Just so if there's any SEO juice coming to one of your old links, it gets redirected to the new URL and you are in great shape. And that is how easy it is to use the content staging um, feature here in HubSpot. If you have any questions, feel free to drop a comment below or if you want me to dig into any other areas of HubSpot, uh, dude, I'm, I'm up for it. I'm up for the challenge. So let me know, know in the comments below and I'll see you in the next video. Later.